change your mind. Take a chance. On the first day in life. Band life is a bit like a marriage. So what happens when actual marriages between bandmates fall apart? ABBA contained two couples, Bjorn and Agneta, Anna Frieda and Benny. They conquered the charts in the 70s and have sold over 350 million records. The band managed to survive Bjorn and Agneta's separation in 1980. We don't want to discuss our private lives, you know. We don't want to discuss it anymore. At least not I. There's no question, it's working really well. And the divorce was because we couldn't live together. That's all. Heartbreak can, of course, lead to great music. Bjorn channeled his grief into the classic song, Winner Takes It All. He'd been at home with a bottle of whiskey by his side, which he more or less emptied as he wrote uh, these lyrics. It took maybe an hour for him to write those lyrics. It turned out to be a masterpiece. I don't want to talk about things we've gone through. Bjorn brought the lyrics to the studio, showed them to Anietta, who read them through, and actually she was so moved, she started crying in the studio. But there were no winners when Benny and Frida divorced the following year. It was the beginning of the end for ABBA. The papers recently have been full of stories that you're going to split eventually. Uh, you're not, no. <laughs> it would be more of a feeling, I think, because when we were recording an album, we would feel that it's not fun anymore. We haven't got anything more to give, and that would be the time to split, you know. Mm. You should have done that a long time ago. Then. <laughs> I know. <laughs> ABBA never formally split up. They never stood on a balcony and said, goodbye, everyone, this is the end of the ABBA story. And I think that's why we're still so fascinated with them. But even a reported offer of $1 billion has failed to persuade ABBA out of retirement. They're never going to do it for the simple reason that they, A, they don't need the money, and B, they're not interested in being ABBA again.